Good morning. Okay, hi. Good morning. Hey, hey. Can you hear me? Hey, listen. Hey, listen. Think back. Search your memory for an image of yourself. Huh? Oh, okay. You want me to name? Uh code names are displayed during multiplayer. Oh, uh DJ. Yes, I guess this will be just in case I ever do the multiplayer, which I probably won't. Uh Ah! Damn it! No, go back! Finally, we are on our way. That's what you look like now. It took us 45 minutes, but uh, <laughs> we made a fancy man. It's a pity that most of that customization would be lost underneath the orange. Yet. Hello, who are you? Ooh, that is sensitive. Hold on. Uh, settings. Camera. Yeah. Set it to 40 each. Uh, let's see if that's better. Yes, that is better. Okay. Hi. We finally meet. Are you clear-headed? I don't know, am I? You will now be reborn as an immortal creature. A revenant. Gasp! There are things you will need to know in your new life. So listen well. Each revenant has a different power coursing through their veins, called a blood code. Is that why this game is called Code Vein? The best way to learn about it is to try it for yourself. <laughs> is that the reason why this game is called Code Vein? Uh, check your blood code. Open field menu. Revenant says special blood code. Currently put blood code on the menu screen. Uh, oh. Ah, so okay, is these like character classes. That is a fighter blood code, which is excellent in combat. Each talent that a blood code bestows is known as a gift. The fighter blood code grants ever-increasing endurance. It seems you also have a gift that temporarily enhances your attack power. Try it out. What? Try equipping adrenaline. Revenants can be using some such gifts. Which gifts can be used depends on Revenants blood code passive gifts. Grants constant effects might be equipped while active gifts must be used to grant effects. Okay, so these uh, down left right. Oops. Uh, adrenaline. Temporary boost is attack power. Give it a try. Uh, shift plus F1, F2, F3. Oh my god. Wait, it's, it, wait is it shift? Or is it caps lock? Uh, okay. No! I don't know what button this is. <laughs> is it this shift? No, is it this shift? Why is it, why is it right shift? Uh? <laughs> okay, hold on a second. <laughs> It's a, it's just the controls, I guess. Whoops. Yeah, I need a controller for this. This is definitely a controller based, a controller based game. Uh, okay. Are there any keys on my keyboard that don't require me? That aren't bound, so I can use this as a gift menu. Okay. So this and everything. Yes, that will yep. Be warned. I forgot something important. That. Whoops. You will need special blood to activate gifts. This blood comes from revenants who have forgotten themselves and turned into monsters. The lost. You can drain icon from the lost by striking them with your weapon. Remember that. Okay. Those are the basics of a fighter's gifts. Use and learn. Oh, oops. Uh, lock onto an enemy. Weak attack, strong attack, charge, hold, dodge, guard, switch weapons. Okay. Ah. Okay, there we go. Okay, that's not so bad. And Q recenters the camera while I'm not in fu combat, okay. Well done. Ordinarily, a revenant has only one blood code. But you are different. Your mouth doesn't move when you're talking. The blood code you once held was broken and has vanished. That has left you with infinite possibilities. You have the unique talent to change your blood code. Come, look deep within yourself. Code owner unknown, Ranger. Provide support and defensive buffs with gifts. Okay, so I can do this. That blood coat is known as Ranger. Oh dear, that weapon seems to be too heavy for you. Rangers are nimble and best at fighting with light weaponry. Try switching to a bayonet. So a knife. Uh, a bayonet. Oh, it's a rifle. Yes, that's much better, isn't it? Oh, firing your bayonet requires Icor as well. That and gifts means Icor. You fire a bayonet. That's a rifle with a bayonet. Have equipped comes in. Using your blood veil will let you quickly drain icor from the lost. In addition, this can increase the amount of icor you can hold. So it's icor, not icor. Okay, lock onto enemy control plus hold. Uh, oh. Okay. 
uh, left shift plus control plus combat. Okay. Oh, no, no, you don't. Ow! Ow! Come here. Come here. Come here. Damn it. And... Eh. Ah, so if you kill... Okay, so if you hit them with the, that ability, you... Okay. That sums up the Ranger Blood Code and Drainer. Let us try one more Blood Code. Now, turn your gaze inward. Caster! So I guess this is the mage one, I guess. That is what is called the Caster Blood Code. Casters possess powers like magic from a fairy tale. With it, you can use gifts to fire projectiles of blood. Edgy, uh, try using Bloodshot. Uh, so... you learn quickly. Okay. Bloodshot favors range over power. Let's see. Try learning another gift. You can learn gifts by touching missiles. Try it yourself. Your inner missile, press E. So this, I guess. Uh, acquire inherent gifts. This one... So you have bloodshot already. Uh... That, I guess. Yay! The gift. That wasn't hard, was it? Now since you've learned it, why not try it out? So I guess I have to go into my menu to, to assign it to a slot like that. And then hold down. Whee! Boom! It's cost an icor is high. So be careful that you use it at the right time. In addition, its power will change according to the blood veil you equip. Blood veils have different affinities for gifts. It can be complicated. Lock onto enemy in sight. Uh, I guess I just continue casting spells. Oh god. Hey, nope, that's the wrong button. Uh, ow. Uh, there you go. Excellent work. It's all quite sudden, but you picked it up, right? The disappearance of your blood code has left you with unique, limitless capabilities. Not only can you change blood codes, but you can acquire new ones as well. The strength of others can become your own. A talent that you alone possess. Since you are the only one who can do this, your blood is the only teacher you have. Now, Awaken and save the world. Welcome back. Hello. How are you feeling? Uh, hi. Whoa. Okay, the world is dark and dreary. That's fine. The architecture in here is strange. This is like a modern city of some kind, right? After an apocalypse. Don't worry. It's okay. I don't remember either. Oh, okay. Fair enough. Over there. Over where? Wow, okay. Well, I guess, uh... I can't run very- I can't move very fast, unfortunately. It's dry, isn't it? Moisturize me! We can go slowly. <laughs> yeah, the game is not letting me go any faster. Green and white. I am here with you. Just a bit farther. Moisturize me. I have been- <laughs> You've been waiting to get cut off by a cutscene? <laughs> It seems everyone, everywhere, is thirsty. There is a spring that will cure that thirst. One that weeps tears of blood. That's what they said, anyway. This way. It's all right. the cloth what are you doing your lady lady what are you doing
What even is this game? Me and my blue lips. <laughs> I'm cyanosed. I need air. I need oxygen. So, it is you. What? I'm assuming those are my like my Estes flasks or something. Smash it against my face. Here. This is for you. I'm assuming these are the health potions slash Estes flasks of this game. A new spring and a fresh source of labor. <laughs> we really hit the jackpot. Get up. It's time for a bit of fun. On your feet. We're about to go hunt for blood beads. Hurry up and get ready. Here we go. Then. Whoa, keep it down. Your friend just fell asleep. Okay, am I in control now? Oh, interesting. Hi. The view never improves, does it? He came back home after the war against the Queen and found this mist? Getting close to it causes enough pain to drive you mad. So no one has ever crossed it. There's nowhere to go home to, even outside of this prison. Okay. A mask. Check your gear, come up. Looks like the folks upstairs want you. Well, they can wait, can't they? More important. Yeah, that mask suits me, but eh, whatever. I'm here to play a game. Now, give me a sword and I can go and stab some things or something. At least that's this how I'm understanding. Dry. The miasma's pretty thick. It's miasma, not miasma. Damn it! We're running out of time before the next collection. Everything's ready. Right, I'm on my way. <laughs> all dried up, just like the others. What? Yeah, all dried up. So there's no sense in searching with the miasma like this. Let's. Oh well. You know what these are, right? Blood beads, right? Yes, very good. Now I want you to search for blood beads in the tunnels ahead of here. You see, it's only a short time before the collectors come to take our levy. But once they do, I'm afraid we won't have any blood beads to give them. Hmm. If we don't find some, Silva's hounds will strip the shirts right off our backs. Well, that's the long and short of it. W why does it have to be us? Don't ask me. The stupid levy system was Silva's idea. If you have a complaint, I suggest you take it up with him. Huh. You Exposition, I guess. Get to work. Exposition? Uh, like a convenient means of telling us about the story or something. Don't. There's a better time and place. For now, we just have to obey. I guess. Next. Okay, I guess it's the three of us. Uh... Hello there. You wait here with us. Of course. You can have this one back when you return. In exchange for any blood beads you find, of course. Game oh, and I like hear that. the hunter has been showing up around here lately. So make sure you don't all get killed. Oh. Oh, that popped a crick in my back. Okay. I probably need a controller for this, but I'm. You I'm... heard him. Move it! Ah! <laughs> Ouch. Hey, you okay? Yeah, I'm okay. It looks like we can't get back up from here. We'll have to look for another way back. You know, if you stood on my shoulders, I could probably just hoist oh, you up into that I'm ladder. Oliver right? Collins, by the way. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. Uh, I am DJ. Sit down.